Hi Sagittarius, welcome. This is your December tarot reading. We're going to go into the energy for you, see what message we get. Um, if you've got Sagittarius anywhere in your chart, you may resonate. I have Sagittarius in my chart, so let's see what message we get. Um, thanks for subscribing, thanks for supporting. Okay, Sagittarius. We're here. Oh, <laughs> Spirit is really close to you, helping you deal with different things going on in the physical reality in your life. Okay, we're here. <laughs> they're letting you know. This could be loved ones from Spirit or Spirit Guides, and they're just very close to you in December, supporting you with stuff. Especially to do with your physical reality and how you deal with it. Here of the fiery sword they're giving you great willpower and determination so you're going to notice that you are way more aligned and determined <laughs> to deal with something um in the physical reality that you may have found very difficult previously but it's like spirit just coming in vroom, to help you to help you deal with it okay um let's go a bit deeper Okay, you were stuck, you didn't know what the hell to do, <laughs> it was all in the mind, um, you weren't really stuck, you could have just done whatever you wanted to do, but it was just probably very consuming in the mind, uh, thinking about what to do about something. Um, but in December you get great clarity, much better mastery over your emotions, um, I think that's what Spirit is supporting you with, so that you are able to mentally perceive your life in a more beneficial way <laughs> right uh, basically see things from the higher mind instead of viewing things from the ego from fear um from stress from worry from high level emotions you're not in that egoic space uh, somehow spirit powers through you in december maybe even right now as i'm doing this reading and they're helping you gain more mastery over your ego so that you don't put so much fear and anxiety into the future um, and you don't allow any thoughts really to dominate you to confuse you or stress you out because that is what your thoughts had been doing your thoughts had been either stressing you out or keeping you stuck and that's not going to be the case you're going to start moving forward and you're going to start moving forward in your mastery. Yeah, the mind is not going to rule you anymore. Because the, here the fiery sword also is to do with intellect. Great willpower and determination and great intellect, you know. So that's what spirit's helping you with. Using your intellect in a more useful, productive way rather than the kind of way that freaks you out. <laughs> and that's, let's face it, we all want to be able to do that. Um, now you come out of December as a queen of wands. Look at that. Amazing. It's going to be so much benefit to you in December for your work, your life purpose, your passions. You're going to be more confident. You're going to be more attractive. You're going to be more um, happy, <laughs> more confident, you know, because you've it's kind of like you're mastering your own self. So you can kind of deal with situations. But I want to say that. The progress you make, you're going to somehow know that Spirit's been helping you with it, okay? Oh, just as I say that, that is so freaking amazing. King of Cups represents Spirit Guides, and that just came out. So, you, yeah, you're, you're going to know that the reason why you're finally mastering something and able to move forward with your life properly is you, because you know and you sense Spirit is helping you. So you're not imagining it. And that's why your life starts to progress now. Um, let's see what your person's thinking. Now, also, you could have a sensitive or spiritual lover here <laughs> coming in for you. Who'd be greatly attracted to you. And there's also somebody here saying, I am quiet to protect you from my ego. Okay. But there is, th that card did come out in reverse. I just want to say. 
So there could be somebody who's been very quiet because of their ego, they were trying to protect you or something like that. They may communicate with you in December, right? I don't know who this person is, but they could be communicating with you in December where they've been very quiet previously because this card can also represent communication. Let's see what spirit is supporting you with. This is your spirit guides. Seduction, allure, desire and manipulation. <laughs> now, you're going to have a lot of seduction powers <laughs> in December because you've got Queen of Wands energy, which is extremely seductive. Um, you know, and your spirit guides are basically saying like, geez, you know, we are helping you to be very attractive and in your power you're moving forward you've slayed some demons and you're coming into your own in december they're also going to be helping you to be very vigilant to any desires so that you don't become addictive or uh, tempted in areas you don't want to be tempted so you're going to have good willpower and sort of um you know you're going to be in your power and Mm, temptations might be there but you're not going to change yourself just because of the temptation you're going to actually be saying well this is who i am do you want it if you do you know what you need to do right so quite interesting interplay between you and the matrix in december i don't feel you're so much under the control of the matrix as in you're getting a better um you're becoming into your power and you're getting a better um a better sort of, uh, I wouldn't say you're in control of the matrix, but you're definitely more in your power when it comes to dealing with other people and situations in the matrix. Um, so you don't force things to happen, but things seem to happen quite nicely for you. So get ready. Uh, spirit guides very close, could be attracting a very nice friend or lover here who's sensitive and spiritual. <laughs> All right. Uh, sending you lots of love and peace thanks for subscribing and one love